so people uh, I decided to make a second revision to you because there were something missing that I didn't tell you the thing is when the, the Harley Quinn um, before Harley Quinn uh, leave the the prison because she was there uh, with Joker but she was simulating that she was uh, arrested and she in fact she checked that there by herself after she passed the night with him she decided to check out of the prison and uh, she told him that uh, her family to uh, took her away but it was not the truth she uh, promised him that she was going to visit him in the jail every time and that she was going to stay in the trial tribunal uh, every day when he was uh, being to send uh, to he was being to the trial and uh, in fact she was there but uh, in this moment when she was uh, saying goodbye to him in the prison she told him he was no no and uh, i don't know uh, he told her that uh, he was in doubt in this moment he told her that he was in doubt uh, if she uh, about her intentions with him and she told him that she was pregnant so harley quinn uh, armed a, a situation to tell a joker that she was pregnant but we, in fact, we don't know that it was only fantasy of his, uh, because it might be a fantasy, a creation, and uh, she lives. After this, she lives. He doesn't know if <laughs> she's uh, having a baby or not, but we think, we may think that uh, it's a, j a joke, it's a lie. <clears throat> and uh, after that, I'm gonna speak skip some things because I have told you, you before when the, uh, he got the sentence, sentence of the trial saying that he's guilty someone that we don't know who it might have been Harley Quinn or not uh, the, this someone uh, bombs the, the tribunal so uh, uh, it's a big explosion like a terrorist act and uh, Joker got um, uh, he saved there uh, by the fans so the fans put him in a, in a car and he escapes and then he runs away from the car and uh, in a certain moment he goes back to his place where he lived before he got in jail it's he, he decides to do this because Harley Quinn, uh, in a certain moment when they were together in the prison, she tells him that uh, she moved to the, that place and that she was taking care of his place so they could live together and have a family. And he uh, and uh, they could live together after he escaped from the prison so he goes there when he reaches the, the this moment is very disappointing guys when he reaches the stairs of new york stairs that stairs that make the joker number one very famous when joaquin phoenix sings and dances and uh, run from the police he saw Harley Quinn sitting in the stairs and uh, very sad. So he goes into her and he tells, uh, now I'm free from the prison, I've escaped. And she tells him, no, I don't want, and, and, and he tells, we can uh, start a family from the beginning. And she tells him, no, no, I don't want anything with you because you told everyone there that you are not the Joker. But in fact, at this moment, he was um, characterized as the Joker and uh, he was covered by some uh, rest of the explosion, but he was the Joker as the character. 
and she tells him that she doesn't want anything with him that because he told everybody that he's not the Joker and then Joker doesn't exist and then she goes up and she gives him, him her back and she goes away in this moment he stays there the police goes after him and he is arrested uh, one more one more time so he goes back to the prison and then in the prison and uh, the very first moments he is murdered by another uh, prisoner that uh, he is murdered with many cups of uh, knives and he's he at the same time that he's murdering there he he gets murdered there in the in jail he is shot by harley queen in the head he gets a shot in his head by harley queen during a presentation of this program that uh, the program was harley queen and joker she takes a gun and she um uh, a point a gun to his head and she shots him because he says to her that uh, the, the, the show is only about her now it's not about him anymore and that she was not looking into him and uh, that she only want, wanted the audience and the public and she takes she just takes a gun and she puts in his hand and she explodes his hand, hand. Uh, the exactly uh, she does the exactly thing that she was uh, threatening him when they met in the in the prison because she she was not uh, characterized at, at, uh, as Harley Quinn in the prison she was as a very normal girl so the point is uh, just to conclude this the second continuation of the review. Uh, this movie is very disappointing. Uh, besides of being a, 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 an attempt to be an, a, a musical, but because it's not a musical, we cannot consider that it to be a musical just because Lady Gaga sings uh, some uh, music and also Joaquin Phoenix sings some music. We cannot consider it, it to be a musical, but it's a mix and... Uh, this is confusing because uh, it's not one thing that, and it's not another thing and uh, it's very complicated because it doesn't uh, go deep in one uh, in one thing nor into another that is interpretation uh, besides of that uh, what I was going to, to tell you is that uh, neither Joker uh, or Arthur Miller, neither the, the character of Lady Gaga, they transform they themselves completely in the other character. That is to say, Arthur Miller doesn't transform himself completely in Joker. And uh, Lady, the Lady Gaga uh, character doesn't become the full and the completely Harley Quinn. So that's something that is um, not into one and not and not into the other thing. They, they both of them are not completely the Arthur Miller, not the Joker, as the character of the Lady Gaga is not completely that uh, person uh, that uh, she's a, a kind of psycho uh, psychotic girl and she's not completely the Harley Quinn the transformation of both doesn't get full it stays in the middle and it's not completely in the, both sides so it's very strange because this is very different from the the first Joker because in the first Joker move movie uh, Arthur Miller got fully transformed into the Joker that we got to know and he finishes the move as a Joker 
we see the transformation. In the second movie, we don't see this. We see a beginning of transformation, but he doesn't transform himself. In the personality of Joker, jo Joker doesn't appear to be completely the move. Uh, the movie is boring and sad and disappointing because of this. And the same thing is to that car new character that is Harley Quinn and maybe the sequence, if it will have a sequence, because in my opinion, it won't have a sequence, but maybe they will decide to make a move based only in Harley Quinn person, uh, character because uh, she survived uh, and uh, in a certain way and also because she told that she was pregnant and uh, for me it's, uh, it was a joke and that because uh, we didn't see her in the, in the, in the character so it's disappointing. Uh, anyone that wants to, to see the, uh, she as Harley Quinn and him as Joker running in the streets and the, in the stairs in New York and uh, doing things together, we won't see this in, the, in this movie. This movie doesn't show us this. And uh, Joker is dead. Joker dies. Maybe it can be another move based in Harley Quinn because she didn't transform herself in Harley Quinn. She was starting the transformation little by little, putting the makeup, putting the hair, and putting the, the costume, but she didn't show it her. She didn't show what she does. She just t told Joker in, uh, in a scene in the prison that uh, she burned her house. But then the lawyer told that it was a lie. And then the, in one scene that she tried to burn the, the, the room of the, where they make the musical in the, inside the prison. But she tried to. Also, we can consider that maybe she was the one that bombarded, make the bombs and the explosion in the trial. But I think that she, if she had done this, uh, she would tell Joker in, at that moment. Anyway, in my opinion, uh, it was a very deception, a gross deception. Uh, I expected to see more the Joker more of the Joker. We don't see neither the Joker, neither Harley Quinn, and uh, the other characters that, to me, in my opinion, they wouldn't have... Uh, uh, we, would ha we wouldn't have needed of them in the movie. Uh, this exploration of the characters of uh, cops and uh, lawyer and the other uh, lawyer of the state, it, they won't be necessary at all, at all. Anyway, uh, I, I miss the old Joker, I miss the Joker number one, but I regret because uh, it seems to me that uh, we won't have Joker anymore. This decision uh, might have been taken by the Warner Brothers Studios and uh, we don't know. But it's very deception, it's very disappointing to know that they won't sing together, they won't make any number, and it's not uh, as you, anyone was expecting. It's, uh, it comes to be very far from what we could expect from Joaquin Phoenix and Lady Gaga together, because in my opinion, they, they uh, both of them could have given, could have been explored much more some points we can uh, we can see Lady Gaga to be the same character of the move I start being born just changing the makeup that because this makeup only appears uh, once in the end and just changing her costume she's it was almost the same person almost the same person 
as the other move she made with uh, Bradley Cooper, a star was born. So that's it, guys. Thank you by watching and stay focused. Bye.